So think about the situation, you know, wherein you as a business owner is uh, definitely missing on those grounds and uh, you have to take care of all the day-to-day -day operational activity. You have to take care of all the business, act you know, all the operational activity which your team who were supposed to take it off. So in short, you know, as a business owner, if you are firefighting with the situation wherein it's like in and out and you are left out with nothing, I mean, in terms of your day-to-day -day schedule, then probably high time it has come that you have to take a call on that and you have to ensure that that your your team stands by when it comes to the right the deliverables and also the expected outcome equally as well. <clears throat> Hi, this is Avik, Avik Sa, business coach and a consultant equally as well. In this journey of building a better business owner, building better business, uh, you know, uh, you know, uh, to to address and build it for uh, a micro, small, and medium business owners like you, building, helping and building better teams, better, uh, healthy and a sustainable and a scalable business equally as well. I'm a founder of Better Business, a Better Life. I'm on a mission right now to build it uh, the same for business business owners like you. So watch this video till the end, and here I'll give you all those clarity and in insights in terms of you know, building a winning team and that would definitely give you a bulb on moment and, you know, a way ahead journey in terms of building it effectively equally as well. So when it comes to, you know, taking it to the next level, so that there's a gift also till the end of this video. If you are there, you will be able to get that as well. So I would, I would suggest that stay till the end and, uh, you know, grab enough note with pen and paper and uh, enjoy, you know, yeah, and, and you know, be a part of the experience in the enjoying the gift as well. So yes, as I was sharing you, you know, in terms of uh, building a winning team. So what really matters is uh, is the, the the understanding or the dynamics of the team to understand. So you know, as a business owner, if you are building everything, then you are building nothing. That's the first point. The second point is uh, you need to understand that the dynamics of team and you know environment or building as such. So when I talk about dynamics of team environment and building as such, so what I mean by that is essentially, uh, <clears throat> you know, there are four categories or types of team that can be taken care of. You know, the first type is uh, more with respect to team essence, wherein you can have a high results uh, team which, which delivers high results and high relationship. A team which can deliver low results and high relationship so that is more of a kind of a you know a nagging team as such you can also have a team which delivers high relationship but low results which is a high results but low relationship which is again a kind of slavery and then you can all again have a team which delivers low results and low relationship and you understand what what i mean by that right so essentially you have to point out a winning team which delivers high results and high relationship a balance of both and unless you have that then obviously as a business owner as a business owner you will not going to end up anywhere as such so how do you make that happen and how do you make it more precise so that as a business owner you can count on those words you can count on those vouch that yes it has to be a high results and high relationship business for that matter so the best and effective way to do that is to ensure that you have enough connect with your teams in terms of their aspirational goals with the business goal. So what I mean by that, if the business goals are not tied up with the individual aspirational goals, you know, their personal finances, their career goals, then probably it will not connect the business goals. So you need to connect the dot of business goals and involve your team in, in those buying meetings. So it is not just dumping your business goals on them. It is more of a co-creation that happens with the team. It is more on the ground that, you know, with those co-creation, you get a buying from the team in terms of delivering the commitments, uh, considering that their career goals and their financial goals are, are, are noted with the business goals. And that's where the entire thing comes up where they're able to express themselves and then they are able, they are in a situation to go with your, uh, with your, uh, you know, business goals overall for that matter. Otherwise, it doesn't matter how much ta task or activity you talk about, you'll end up nowhere. Trust my words, you'll actually end up nowhere. So you have to gain those momentum when it comes to operational excellence by the team and making it sure that there's always a balance between the relationship and the results that we discussed. You know, in the, in the previous pointers. 
so once that gets aligned in terms of their personal aspirational goals their career goals the financial goals that's where you connect the dot with the business goals and take those buying and commitments right uh, so that's that's the you know the next pointers which comes as well and once you are able to do that successfully what really makes the difference is how do you do that so it's always those one to ones it can be in your business review meetings weekly meetings uh, kind of uh, fortnight meetings but it has to be there some way or the other and when you do those one to ones just make sure that you're not going with typically with business discussion those one to ones will cover all aspects of their career so it can be related to their, their financial goals their health issues their relationship with yourself and you know all that stuff so when you cover that as at a very holistic level those one to ones that makes a very very smooth conversation and only with those powerful education followed by those smooth conversation it brings the commitment so i repeat it's those powerful education followed by those smooth full conversation and that's where it brings the commitment as well okay so it's an education then it's a conversation and then it's a commitment yeah and of course when you, you know when you go by this pattern when you go by this belief you understand that yes how it is bringing the commitment on the table as well and last last but not the least when you understand this mechanism you know well you also need to ensure that yes it gets delivered on the table now because now that you have complete understanding of their for a person who goes on financial goals now that you have understood understanding of the fact of the dynamics of the team now that you have also ensured that there is an engagement process i mean through the conversation through those powerful education and through those one to ones so that's where it brings the commitment and basis which uh, the last but not the least what really matters is to ensure that the deliver the results will only not be delivered even if they committed if if either of these three pillars are lacking in the overall environment so what are those three pillars understanding the fact that the commitment is there right now so the three pillars are the right strategy or the direction for the business the right skills and the right efforts you know once you're able to do that you should be able to make it happen as well so with that you know i i i come to the end of this video as well and i'm sure uh, this will give you enough i think to take a word and take it to the next level and download it with this shared in the link below as well that will help you to also understand and gain the momentum in terms of taking the journey way ahead equally as well so download the link below which is shared below as well that will help you to understand and gain the overall uh, you know uh, the gift that i was sharing to you so there's a gift as well so download that and make sure that you you are able to get the gift equally as well the gift worth 5000 rupees in the marketplace that's a little free of cost you can get it you know absolutely free by downloading the link below and uh, share your comments and feedback i would like to understand your takeaways and learn equally as well and this is which i would uh, uh, you know i would you know you would be able to get tons of videos like this way ahead of you as well but that will also give me uh, more clarity of sharing such powerful and quick clarity inside the video today till then have a wonderful day ahead and take care and enjoy your journey yeah and uh, do share your comments equally as well uh, so that you are able to get more such powerful videos till then have a wonderful day bye bye take care bye bye